This is Broadway Sandwich. We're hanging out with your favorite Broadway performers to find out what they do in their few short hours sandwiched between their matinee and evening performances. Join me as we find out what makes up the meat in this Broadway Sandwich. We're at the Gerald Schoenfeld Theater, where the matinee of Come From Away is just about to end. Come From Away is the true story about a tiny town in Newfoundland in the days after 9-11. The people in town opened their arms and homes to strangers in a time of fear and tension. The result is an incredible story of kindness and generosity. This cast of only 12 actors portray over 30 roles in the show. The cast was amazing. I just love that there wasn't one star. I loved how they flip flop with their roles. Today we're meeting up with Caesar Samayoa. Caesar's two main characters are Kevin J, a man who just wants to go home, and Ali, an Egyptian Muslim. Hey, hey! How are you? How was your show? It was awesome. Oh it was amazing. Gosh. So hot. That's burning hot. But it feels great. <laughs> it's literally the dead of summer. So we're going to teach a class right now. Yes. I teach it's a good three to five times a week. Yeah. It's one of my passions. And you don't find that tiring with all the other with eight shows a week? I find it energizing. I find this show energizing. Hi, how are you? Hey. Thank you so much for being here. I'm so excited to be teaching you all. So we go one, two, three, four, stop. If you could repeat, I'm an islander, I am an islander, 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 I'm an islander, I am an islander. Yes! <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for coming to this class and really giving it your all. It is such an honor to share this material with you. Okay, so class is done. Yes. That was really inspiring. I'm so glad you came. Absolutely. This is the coolest thing. Where are we gonna go? I'm thinking of taking you to Gotham Market. I just wanna dig in. Go for it, please, 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 please. So before you took the show to New York, you took it to Gander and performed it there. Yeah. What was that like? It was one of the best experiences of my life. You're, you're playing this show for 5,000 people, and when you think there is only a little bit over 7,000 people at that point, that were there. That was the population right. of- So everybody came <laughs> to the theater. There, so, yeah. Or the hockey, it was an ice it rink. Was in, in the ice hockey rink that we talk about. But it, it became this huge rock concert because you would say the name Beulah and Beulah would be sitting right there in the second row. Beulah! And the, the whole place would just be like, Beulah! Oh, man. And we start the show and there's this amazing drum beat that's kind of like the heart of the show. And the first thing that we all say in the show is, I'm an islander, I am an islander. I'm an islander. As soon as we said that, the whole audience just went crazy. I mean, they went crazy. People just leapt up, and you saw every one of us just start crying, like, all oh, down the line. And it was amazing. It was completely life-changing. <laughs> um, so listen, I have a couple of minutes left before the show. Do you want to see the dressing room? I would love to see I have so much room. to show you back here. Okay, perfect. So Let's cool. go. On in. We have so much memorabilia from, yeah. like, everything. We have fan art, we have quilts, we have anything in print that was done about our show yep. or about a cast member. It's all leading all the way up to our dressing room. So cool. So this is my dressing room. It's, it's um, gorgeous. It's like so calm, and there's this beautiful window that looks over all the theaters here. You and Chad. Me and Chad Kimball. So nice. Yeah. Most beautifully decorated dressing room I've seen in eight episodes. You win the award. Now, do you nap on that? 
<laughs> Chad, Chad up naps and on cozy. that actually. He just curls up Aww, into a ball. Like a little cat. <laughs> so cute. I love this little guy. This is like an exact replica of my costume. Most of the characters in the show, if not all, are based on real characters or uh, amalgamations of different characters put into one, right? Yes. And so one of your characters, Kevin, is based on an actual Kevin. Yes, Kevin Young. And that's him. And that's him. We are dear friends. And that's Jen Colella with Captain Beverly Bass, which is one of the characters that she plays too. This is uh, an Officer's World Trade Center pin. Yeah. This is an NYPD tie clip uh, <laughs> that a detective, she gave it to me. She wore it at um, a funeral of one of her, one of her officers. It's overwhelming sometimes. It just makes me think about how much we're reaching people with this show. Each one of those pieces of fan art, each gift that we give, it's someone kind of showing their love for this show and this story. Yeah. And I hear it often, over and over again, that people finally have something else to think about. Right. Uh, they think about the goodness of humanity rather than the terror that happened that day. I love this because this is all of our playbills from every production. So total, how many come from aways will there be? Five come from aways. Unbelievable. Yeah. This is amazing. When we when we did the concert in Gander, um, this was over the town hall, and the mayor took it down, Mayor Claude, and now we have it backstage. Uh, we always have a light on it, and um, it's amazing. It's just a reminder of you know what we're doing here and yeah. how it's. It's all real. <laughs> Absolutely. The time. And then these other flags? These are all outlying towns. They started sending us their flags as well. People, towns that had come from aways. Yeah. So, so the people are known, people who are not from Newfoundland, who are not born there, are known as come, come from, from aways. Yeah. And these are the different towns that had come from aways during that week. We have to mention those trees. Yes. Incredible. My favorite, favorite part of any kind of tour. I love showing people our stage. Um, this, the Schoenfeld Theater is so beautiful. Look how close the people are. I know. It's almost like a black box feel, but you have 1,080 seats in here, so a lot of people fitting, but that's actually one of the smaller Broadway houses, right? It is, yeah. it is. It's amazing. We actually, get, we're directed to talk, like, talk to people to them, like really? look in their eyes and talk to them and tell the story. And we're standing on a turntable. Yes. And so this whole disc rotates. This whole disc rotates throughout the show for different scenes. Um, and chairs, basically, chairs and two tables create everything that happens on this stage. What you see on this stage right now is what we have uh, to tell the story. And we have our incredible band uh, on either side of the stage. It's like, it's such an important part of the, yeah, of the story. I love the details and everything. This. Um, this color here, this blue that's taking up almost yeah. our entire set, represents the color of the sky in New York on 9-11. A beautiful, beautiful day. Caesar, this has been so wonderful spending time with you and getting to hear about how special this show is. We are huge fans and we're just thrilled for everything you're doing. Thank but you. you have to do your second show. You have I to do. get back to work. Do you hear it? We're getting I know, ready. exactly. You're ready to go, so I'm gonna get out of here. See you amazing. soon. Thank you so much. Thank you, Caesar. Bye. Thanks. Bye.